Planning continues for the Metro Blue Line light rail extension, but with the existing railroad corridor off limits, the other option is for the train to travel down the middle of County Road 81. That raises some concerns as it goes through Robbinsdale. We know that County Road 81 is in some places quite narrow. Uh, there's a lake on one side, there's a railroad tracks two blocks away on the other side, and a lot of activity that's between uh, those two spaces. It's a very small space for the Robbinsdale Commercial Core District. Running light rail down the center of 81 would require 28 feet of width. How would that space be freed up for the train? Traffic lanes could be narrowed. Parking for businesses could be reduced slightly. There's also a proposal to eliminate the southbound right-hand turn lane just past McDonald's that's used to enter the business area there. Another right turn on southbound 81 that could be eliminated is the entrance to the Lakeland Avenue frontage road near Elam Lutheran Church, which does provide quick access to apartments on West Broadway. We're concerned about loss of access and the alternatives in Robbinsdale to get into businesses from another direction. There are not a lot of alternatives and those alternatives don't handle the same capacity of traffic as is handled by County Road 81. So it could lead to uh, congestion on areas that are already congested during peak, peak times. Trying to figure out how to, how to take the additional 28 feet out of what's already there and, and how various things would be impacted is definitely an engineering challenge. The city is also figuring out how future redevelopment of the area will factor in, as well as how to make safe crossings for bikers and pedestrians. The possibility of elevating the train is another option. Can you put those structures out, up in the sky and would that help with the impacts to the uh, properties on the sides? That would help a little bit with the width issue, but it would create additional challenges, different sorts of challenges. The city of Robbinsdale is hoping to thoroughly explore the options and uncover those challenges while planning is still in the early stages. Hennepin County and the Met Council have issued a draft route modification report to make sure the project's goals are still being met. There's an opportunity now through Tuesday, January 25th, to read the report and provide your opinion. Let us know what you think. Is this where the, the route should go to? Um, do we believe that this route is going to be a successful route through the cities? Something that people believe that they would use? something that would help them to get to where they need to go in a more efficient manner. Go to bluelineext.org to find out more about the project, read the draft route modification report, and see design ideas for the Robbinsdale area. Learn more about the connection at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.